Good morning. It's, um, what is it? Thursday morning. I've been in Arizona since, wow, I can't even remember. I left on Sunday, got here on Monday, and now I'm in Yuma. I'm parked in a Walmart parking lot. It's a nice Walmart. I like that there's other campers here. Um, it feels really safe. And uh, it's a nice clean Walmart, big enough to get, it's got, well, it's Yuma, so it has lots of camping stuff. So I'm gonna go in there in a little bit and get my hair cut. Hopefully they have room to get me in today because I really need a haircut and I really need a sh uh, like I really need to wash my hair. So, um, Anyways, it's been nice not uh, making myself rush to do things and just, I think every time I come down to Arizona, I need to take a few days to wrap my head around being in my van again, um, figure out what that looks like, especially since I've changed my van around a little bit. And it always seems like I throw a bunch of stuff in at the last minute before I leave and then there's no way to organize it all. So. I've done a, quite a bit of organizing now, and I'm still not sure that it's the final plan, but I don't know, watching other YouTubers that are um, van lifers, I think vans are always a work in progress, prog sorry, always a work in progress. All right, this is how I get my Sorry about the light in the background, but this is how I get my wheelchair out in the morning. So I have a control for it. I left Yuma today heading for Tucson. I think I'm about an hour out of Tucson and I'm parked for the night on, uh, it's not BLM, it's like Monument Land or something. That's what my app says. Uh, so there's these two little holes right next to my campsite. I don't know if they're for mice or tarantulas or snakes, but uh, I've lifted my chair right up off the ground right away because I don't want anything coming in my van tonight. I've always had a problem finding lights that are bright enough to light up my van so that it feels good in here. This little one, $4.97 at Walmart, $4.97 American dollars at Walmart. I love it, I think I'm gonna get another one and actually, I think I figured out it does different things. Duller, red, strobe, off. Anyways, I think I'm pretty happy with that purchase. Okay, I'm camped just uh, about an hour outside of Tucson. I left Yuma this, this afternoon. I'm meeting up with my friends who live in Mexico, and we're going to spend the weekend in Tucson and then head down to Mexico. Assuming I don't have any troubles with stuff that I have to um, get on my van to go down there. I got, I have to register it and insure it. I don't know, there's a bunch of stuff I gotta do. So, gotta figure that out. And hopefully if all works out well, then I will follow my friends down to their place, which is about, I don't know, four hours south of the border so I'm excited about that I haven't haven't really been in Mexico ever I've been at a port that I stopped at on a cruise and I've been to Tijuana and that's about it so um 
anyways, very excited about the coming days. And also excited about the new lamp. Where did it go? There it is. And then I put batteries in this one. So this one is also lighter. So it's actually light in my little cab, my little van. So it's nice to have that much light. And also it just, I'm kind of giddy tonight because it just feels really good to have everything organized. Have it kind of set up for the evening. So yeah, life is good. Good morning. It's a beautiful morning out there. I've spent the morning in my time with God and now working on a, getting a video put together. It took me until now, until the van is 30 degrees inside, for me to get warm enough to feel like, oh, okay, I can open up the window now or open up something. So have a look at my gorgeous spot. Great start to a great day. Just thought I'd also give you a bit of a pan around where I've been staying since last night. It's about an hour outside of Tucson and it's just on the side of the highway, Highway 8. That's it for this week. It wasn't a terribly exciting week, but I just am going to turn the phone around for a minute to show you a preview of what's to come. I'm in Mexico right now. I'm in San Carlos, but I've been in a little town called Manamat, Manamachi. Oh man, I can never say that. Benamichi. I've been there for the last probably week or so, and I've got lots of um, video to show you from that. But I'm going to leave you this week with uh, just a hint of a preview of what um, is to come.